In Brockton, an extreme case of animal cruelty ends with a little dog's death. The MSPCA says somebody left this dog in its car carrier outside the shelter and in sweltering heat, and the dog eventually died of heat stroke. WBZ's David Robichaud is live in Brockton tonight with the story, and Roby, it was right there at the shelter. Well, Lisa, the MSPCA says it's possible that this dog owner was just trying to do the right thing by bringing their unwanted pet to an animal shelter. But the problem is they did it when the shelter wasn't open and they dropped the dog off down this driveway near some bushes where it was difficult to see. Now that unknown dog owner could face time in prison. Joyce Carancy has dedicated her life to helping animals. So what she saw when she was walking a dog yesterday was heartbreaking. It's devastating. Um, you know, it just it undoes so much of the, the good. You know, we, we work so hard for good outcomes for the animals in our care. And just after 8 a.m., she found this dog crate with a female chihuahua inside next to the driveway, away from the main entrance to their shelter. When I took her out, she was completely, I, I thought she was deceased, but uh, felt a heartbeat and realized she wasn't yet. Um, tried to bring her right to our vet over in Stoughton, um, just down the road, and she unfortunately passed away on the way to the vet. The dog's body temperature registered at 109 degrees, the highest they can record on what was a blazing hot day. The MSPCA says this type of thing is common where someone will come by and drop off an animal in an animal carrier, which is fine. But what they have to remember is they must do it during business hours when staff members are here. So we always ask people to get in touch with their local animal shelter, call and find out their surrender process and their surrender hours. There's no shame or judgment in that. When people get into trouble, animals get into trouble, and that's why animal shelters exist. The MSPCA has offered a $1,000 reward for information leading to the culprit. Regardless of the circumstances that led to the person making this decision, animal cruelty is a felony crime in Massachusetts. This dog had died a protracted and agonizing death, um, and as a result, will be prosecuted if we can identify them. The MSPCA tells me that the animal cruelty laws come with some pretty stiff penalties. If this person is caught, they could face fines up to $5,000 and perhaps as many as seven years behind bars. Live in Brockton, I'm David Robichaud, WBZ News.